Hi guys, it's Yudi here and welcome back to another video. So today I will basically be showing you guys how to start combos and get better at PvP in general. Also, before this video starts, only a small percentage of you guys are subscribed, so make sure to subscribe. Also, apparently YouTube has a glitch where people are getting unsubscribed randomly, so make sure you are subscribed. We're really close to 1k subs and I want to make it to my dream job, so yeah. Also, this will work in any PvP-based game, such as Bed Wars, Sky Wars, Pod PvP, Practice any game mode so let's get started so when you are not moving forward in minecraft pvp you will get comboed so you need to stop your opponent's movement and then combo them you can do that by using your fishing rod or any other projectiles even blocks okay so we're in a high pixel you're a chi game so i'm gonna rod him and then i'm gonna hit him which will get him comboed see that another way is simply by placing down block whenever he's running towards you so like this Bam, lagged him back, he's lagging, okay. I'm gonna put some more examples on the screen. And you can use any projectile, bows, eggs, nobles, even blocks, fishing rods. Also, another way to combo people is using speed, which will make it a whole lot easier because their movement is faster than theirs. But what if you don't have any projectiles and just want to combo people in like for example practice? Well the way to do that is by sprint resetting. So you guys know I've made tutorials on W tapping, S tapping, block hitting if you haven't go watch them, they will really help you out. But so you want to use those skills to start of a combo. There are different ways of comboing of course. But I suggest block hitting at the start and then W tapping, S tapping or continue block hitting every like 2 seconds. So for example watch this. Now so imagine this is your opponent right? And so you want to block hit on your first hit and then you want to either continue hitting with W tapping, S tapping or block hitting. Again if you are not sure what that means I will leave a link in the description to some PvP tutorials which will really help you out. Okay so here's the example we're gonna block it for the first hit and then we can S tap or W tap on it. Of course it's gonna be different so let's go fight an actual opponent. Also I've gotten this video and yeah Also I've gotten this video and also I've gotten this video idea from Intel so I'll leave a link in the description to him. I'm just being honest, it's way easier comboing people on Sky Wars or Bed Wars. Not saying that you shouldn't do it in no debuff, but it's, it might be a bit harder because the base might be a bit better though. So here for example we're gonna block it and then we're gonna oh he's just gonna fall off. Let's go get that guy. Hello sir, can we 1v1? Thank you. We're gonna snowball him and then we're gonna block it. Bam, I'm gonna combo. He's kinda laggy, but that's okay. Again, I would really advise you getting speed. It's gonna help you. But you might not always have speed, like here for example. You can still combo people though. There we go. See, we can still combo and kill him. GG. So what if you have an axe for example, you can't block it. I would suggest you guys using a projectile or maybe double your S tapping at the start or uh -oh, to start a combo. Bam, you see that? You don't have to block it again, that's my personal preference instead. And then we're gonna combo that guy off, never mind, we're gonna combo both of them off, bam. See, it's not even hard, you just gotta practice and bam, we win this. Oh no, he's alive. Gap, Ipple. Uh, we won. So basically, block it or don't block it for the first hit. It's personal preference, see which one works the best. And then, you wanna use your projectiles to stop the sprint. Oh my god, I'm failing. To stop the sprint and... Combo him. How am I alive? No clue. And we got him. And we got him, GG. Again, you need to be smart whenever you fight. You need to think about what your opponent is gonna do. And again, you don't have to block it. It might really fail and not work for you guys and you're just gonna get comboed. And instead, maybe try an S tap or W lag tap, which might be better for you guys. So yeah, thank you. See now I F tapped, I W tapped and then I F tapped to finish off the combo. Gonna end the lag, okay. Gonna end the pull over here, we're gonna 
S tab, W tab, just W tab and S tab and use all projectiles to help you. Bam. And if you have a soul, try and block it. It might help you as well. Can you stop punning, sir? I'm gonna kill you. Oh. Thank you, GG. By the way, if you are new, make sure to subscribe. It really helps out a lot. No, it no. You can, it also works in other game modes, not only Sky Wars. I just love Sky Wars and I'm good at it personally. Hello. You can literally combo in any game. Heck, look at those combos. It's so. Uh oh, I'm dead. After you practice it, it shouldn't be too hard. Like you don't have to like just learn how to double it up and stop block it again. Links are in the description. Please go watch it. Oh, uh, I'm gonna clean. So yeah, just double it up, S tap, block it. Well it's not only that of course. Again, I'd recommend personally block it for your first hit. Use projectiles, it's so important and easier using projectiles. Because it stops those points, which means you can literally compose them easily. There we go. Well, not easily, but easier. Anyways, now I can't stress this enough. This takes practice. You can't just learn anything. Don't give up in the first like minute. Be like, oh, your tutorial doesn't work, or I'm so bad, I can't do anything. Just hold on, practice, practice and practice hope you enjoyed this video if you did slam that like button it would really really help out a lot since likes boost the videos also comments do but that's not the point of this video is it anyways make sure to hit that like button subscribe if you are new 1k let's go baby and see you guys until next time stay you did